Hey Capricorn, welcome to your general reading. This reading will be published and is for August. It is a general and will not resonate with everybody, unfortunately. But I do personal readings and I will stick my email address and contact details in the description box, guys. Okay. Um, so already when I was pre-shuffling for Capricorn, I had the Three of Cups jump out and I felt like you're just more in a more happier place right now. Okay, oops, so the hanged man, yeah, um, awakening, getting enlightenment here, Capricorn here. So the hanged man there jumping out for you guys first. So I feel like your situation could be at a standstill or you could be feeling stuck, unable to move forward at the moment here. But while you're in this period of non-movement, you'll be gaining clarity and awakening. Okay, guys, so... Um, it's always important, you know, um, to remember that time alone will be beneficial to you guys. So the Knight of Wands. So somebody is rushing in here. I do feel like this is wanting to communicate rather than, um, you know, this other sort of Knight of Wands energy that we can have, this passionate energy. I feel like... Um, they're waking up here and want to communicate that. So let's see. Oopsie. So yeah, somebody is rushing in here to communicate. Maybe after the situation has been stood still a long time. Page of Cups. So yeah, definite communication coming in. And it's positive communication with the kit page of cups all right guys so it's like um somebody is awakening here and coming forward to communicate so could be that the situation was stuck still no conversation for a long time no communication and now um they awoken here it's like somebody's waking up and coming forward to communicate ten of wands yeah dropping the burden the burden here i feel is like because there was no communication, it's built up and built up on their back and they now have things to say with the Page of Cups, okay? So it will be positive communication there, um, so don't worry about that. It's just like they're now coming to the end of that cycle of um, being stuck because they're awakening with the hanged man. They're getting enlightenment here. Judgment, it's time. It's time to talk, okay, guys? Um, especially this will resonate if your situation has been stuck, you felt no movement with the hangman. Um, it's like they're waking up now here. Um, so they're rushing in. Okay. Because now it's judgment time. I'm doing this on 11th of August. So Lionsgate will close tomorrow. So that is judgment day. Okay. Lionsgate, while we've been through this time, they're going to have this spiritual nudge now to come forward and open up to you, speak to you here. They want to end this burden. It's your soulmate. Two of Cups. They have to come forward. It's like both of you have been enlightened now, okay? Because if you look at this card, the light is between them, okay? And it's in both cups. And I feel they want to offer a cup. And if this is going to resonate with you, it would be you wanting to offer a cup as well, Capricorn, okay? Now's the time to um, offer your cup to this soulmate here. Five of Cups, yeah, they're very sad, they miss you here, okay, and it's built up as this Ten of Wands, it's become like a pressure cooker for them, like, I need to talk now, and that's what um, the Divine has been doing, putting pressure on them, so they feel this Ten of Wands, like, I can't go on, I need to actually reach out, and that's why they're coming in quicker now with the Knight of Wands energy here. OK, it could have been you both feeling this five of cups because it's next to the two of cups here. Um, I feel like maybe you felt confusion with seven cups and they're feeling sadness now. You probably felt sadness in the beginning, but now like confusion. Two of wands, two of wands. A decision has been made because of this judgment day, because of this judgment card here. So a decision has been made now to take action. I like that we have the Knight of Wands being an action card here. So and the Two of Wands, they made a decision. They're going to go forward and take action here. 
Eight of Swords, again, um, don't be overthinking this, okay? Because I feel like maybe you're a little bit confused. They've took so long to come forward. Why are they coming forward now? You could be overthinking things. Again, it could just be an indication of you feeling trapped in this situation, even though you had no contact from them here, because it's like a barrier around you. There was a blockage. So I definitely feel like this can just be... Um, your energy feeling stuck on this person or unable to let them go um, but with the eight of swords there's always a way to let them go okay we have temperance and the lovers fall out okay so this was like a soulmate who taught you a lesson um, the lessons I feel have been learned between you both here um, and it's somebody wanting a second chance so don't be surprised okay that this person wants a second chance with you with temperance it's like um, coming to an agreement with the two of wands here. Um, like, I can't get over this person. I can't stop thinking about this person. Like, they're obsessing about you here. Um, and I feel for you guys, you may feel like they're stuck in your head as well, but that's because they're thinking about you a lot. And they're thinking about, um, like, how come I can't get over them? I feel like it's this divine connection with the lovers here. Um, a very important soulmate in your life. Okay, guys. So they're coming forward to speak now. And it's like after a long time of no communication, bam, they can't take the weight on their shoulders anymore. Um, it's like waking up. They've awoken to, huh, I can't stop thinking about them because, you know, I'm, maybe I'm supposed to be with them. It's like understanding and waking up to this knowledge here after being stuck, definitely being stuck with the hangman, no movement forward. And now they want to rush forward towards you and communicate, guys. Good luck.